Hey guys, back here to do another update video like I usually do. Everything here has been got since my last video. Or earliest I can remember is like October stuff. So um, let's get into the goodies. And um, if I sound weird, I have a cold right now. So I'm sorry. <laughs> but I wanted to make a video. So here we go. Um, first thing I got. Well, the FYE near my place, they reopened. And when they reopened, they remodeled and brought in a lot more stuff. Um, they reduced their DVDs and stuff, but still they have them, so that's cool. And um, when, the f when they reopened, they had a sale on all their DVDs and Blu-rays and all that good stuff. So I decided to finally pick up one of my favorite shows that I saw as a kid and grew up watching. That's The Wonder Years. Kevin Arnold, like Winnie Cooper. This was a great show. If you've never seen it, you have to watch it. Check it out on Netflix. The whole series is on there. And the whole series is on DVD, but as a complete box set so if you buy these individually you'll be waiting a little bit but the fourth season is supposed to come out in January next month so that's cool here's season one season two with Kevin, Winnie, and Paul and season three with the whole Arnold clan definitely check out that show it's it's amazing uh, let's get into the Blu-rays and DVDs uh, I think I I made a video review on this, but this is Pokemon The Johto Journeys. Uh, first time released in America in its entirety as, as a complete set. So that's pretty cool. The front and the back. Um, I did a review on this, so if you want to check that out, that'd be cool. Uh, let's get to the Blu-rays and stuff. Here's Dragon Ball Z Resurrection F. Uh, me and my sister went to see this movie in August when it came out in a, theaters. Um, we saw it at the mall with a pretty lively uh, um, crowd, so... That was cool, and the movie was pretty neat. It's a sequel to Battle of Gods, and nice to say that when this came out, it came out fast, and Best Buy and Walmart had copies, and they had their own little display boxes for it, so it's nice to see Dragon Ball getting some attention here again, like the good old days. If this was Suncoast, they'd be all over it. <laughs> anyway, here's the cover. It's sort of raised or embossed, and it comes with Blu-ray, DVD, and an ultraviolet code. Here's the back. Revenge takes on its final form. Cool. Um, the movie's pretty neat. A lot more action than the last one. Here's the same thing. Open this up, and here's the advertisement for the Extreme Toad and video game. And here's what the Blu ray looks like. The DVD looks the same, too. It's a little disappointing, but that's uh, okay. No worries. Alright, next thing I got was Tiger and Bunny. The Rising movie um, it has Tiger and Bunny in their hero forms with a nice hollow foil slipcover from Viz Media. And uh, this is a sequel to the anime, unlike the beginning movie, which is sort of like an alternate retelling a little bit. But this is pretty cool. Oh, I really like the movie. Um, I hope there's more Tiger and Bunny. It's a great series. I'm, here's Kotetsu, Barnaby, and the newest hero, Golden Ryan. Um, yeah, this was really cool, and you can see the slip cover and the actual Blu-ray cover are different pieces of artwork. That's something more companies should do, because you know there's a lot of great artwork for these shows and stuff. Might as well use it to their advantage, right? Okay, here's the DVD, more artwork, and the Blu-ray, which looks really nice, and a little advertisement for the manga as well, also by Viz Media. Next thing here is Lupin the Third, The Castle of Cagliostro. This is put out by Discotech, and this is the first, I think it's the first directorial movie of Hayao Miyazaki. So if you love his movies or Studio Ghibli and all that good stuff, you'll probably really like this. I've never seen this before, and when I checked it out, it was great. Um, very immersive movie, and it, never a boring scene in the movie. Everything is great and, you know, really nice. Uh, there's Lupin, the Count back there, the Princess and his merry gang of misfits, uh, Fujiko Mine right there, um, Daisuke Jigen and Goemon, and um, the man who's trying to capture Lupin, Inspector Zenigata. Here's the spine. This is my first discotheque Blu-ray too, so it's pretty cool. Uh, Believe in the Thief, and it has a bunch of extras, interviews with the cast, the guys who played Lupin, and every dub that was produced in America by Streamline. Um, by Manga Entertainment, and even a kid-friendly version, which just removes the cursing, so it's pretty cool. 
a really good movie and it has different artwork for the cover. And this is my first Blu-ray that has a tab right here. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, open it up and here's the inside. Here's the RAM ring, the blue one. And uh, there's Lupin in the back with more artwork. So that's pretty cool. And the last thing here is something I've been pretty excited about, and that's Lupin the Third versus Detective Conan. This just came in yesterday. Um, this is the TV special. When Disco Tech announced that they had this, I know it's because they're releasing more Lupin stuff that they can get their hands on. But Detective Conan crossover with Lupin in this TV special, and there's a movie. So that's pretty cool. And if you want to support Case Closed, Detective Conan. Support these releases. It might show Discotech that there's still interest in the series. And um, who knows, maybe we'll get more movies or more of the series brought up. Um, I wouldn't mind. Here's the spine, which looks really nice. Um, it's all full of text and imagery. Pretty cool. Here's the back. The cunning master thief Lupin III versus Detective Conan. The world's greatest sleuth. Is yet another case closed? Or will there be a deadly cliffhanger? Um, only extras are subtitles and liner notes, which is pretty cool. And um, nice little artwork of Conan and Lupin. So this was a pretty fun thing to watch, but um, uh, I hear the movie's a little bit better. But just wanted to support this. Um, I don't. Um, I wanted to show, you know, still support for Case Close. So. And I'm starting to get into Lupin too. I've been watching the Green Jacket series on Crunchyroll. And here's the DVD. Um, it's black with the silhouettes of both Lupin and Conan. And that same artwork on the back as a reverse cover. Pretty cool. And I'll definitely pick up the movie soon. Um, Bright Stuff's having a big sale on all their anime goodies and all that stuff. But yeah. So that's it for now, guys. Um, so little Lupin, uh, Conan stuff, um, Superhero, Tiger Bunny, some DVZ, which is always cool. Pokemon, childhood favorite, and The Wonder Years, another childhood favorite of mine. So that is it for now, guys. Um, until the next video, um, later days.